Good day everybody, this is Pillar from Tales Productions and welcome back to Star Wars The Old Republic and this playthrough of a Trooper Vanguard on a completely free to play account we've just completed um, where Needle should have been. I didn't even get the name of the area, where was that? Nowhere, just an Imperial Research Outpost I think. Um, and we're coming back to hand that in. On the way though, I'm just going to hand this one in and find out if the commander really was embezzling. We don't have antibiotics. They come on the same ship as everything else. You're supposed to keep better tabs on that sort of thing. These men have the Cillian flu. They could die if... Lieutenant, do I read from your face that you brought welcome news? Um, yeah, the supplies are here. Tell your men they're off rationing. Not a moment too soon, Lieutenant. Let me tell you, you really saved my stripes on this one. The men came close to mutiny when I cut rations again. Ah, they knew this wasn't going to be a luxury cruise. What do you expect? You ask your men to starve while you eat Bantha steaks from off-world. Ooh. Um, okay. So, have I actually seen proof that he's embezzling? That So she's... I've seen a few accusations from her. I guess the pictures I took of the engine must have shown that they weren't working, but that doesn't mean he's buying all this random stuff that she says for himself. Hmm. And it's interesting, but I guess... Because of the things my character's done, I'm supposed to assume I have proved he's embezzling, right? These pictures Must prove have. you knew the ship was damaged, and you sent it anyway. There you go. They're going to Republic Command, along with my documentation of every personal purchase you've made. These men left their families and risked their lives to come here. If they die, it should be for someone better than you. I I didn't know the ship was so bad. I thought if it was serious, they'd catch it on Ord Mantel. Hmm. Yeah, okay, so she did have documentation, so it is all proven. Okay, I don't feel so bad now. You should lose your command. The men on terrorists deserve a better leader. This is ridiculous. I did nothing wrong. Republic what? Command will never listen to you. I, I need to call them. Thank you for all your help. But there may be something else, too. Normally, our fourth outpost comes here to pick up its supplies. But their convoy never arrived this month. I'm afraid something happened. Mm. They need to be found. Okay. Um, so you want me to find out? Yeah. Oh, you think they're dead? It's dangerous territory out there. Was the convoy armed? The route between the outposts runs along Lake Brell. Not the best planning. There's Rackles there and a Nexus spawning ground and worse. Usually the convoy's managed by only traveling when the sun is highest. Plus lots and lots of firepower. Mm. But if they're out there too long... You need to find them. Witching a little bit. Okay, then time is of the essence. Every moment we delay risks their lives. I'll leave right now. Whatever happened to the convoy, we need to make sure Morn Outpost gets their supplies. Sonic emitters along the route usually keep off the worst of the critters. But if they're on the fritz, that convoy would have walked into a feeding frenzy. Fix the emitters and see what you can find about the convoy. When you're done, report to Commander Yajek at Morn Outpost. And thank you. Oh, thank you. That's fine. Um, all right. So, I I think I just have a space for that, right? I must be able to equip two. Wow, full again. Oh no, I can't commit. Oh, I did have two equipped. Interesting. Oh yeah, now they're both good. All right, let's um just sell quickly. Is somebody over here? You. Ooh. Okay, so I am going to go back first. Stand by for examination and suggested products. Sell junk. And you are junk. You are junk. Both of these. And can I get rid of one of these? Maybe that one? There you go. Sorted. You're fit for duty. Return to your post. Keep pressing B for the bag. Um, Alright, so I'm going to fly back over to the main area to hand in the trooper storyline and I, I assume they'll send me back to do something over here which will send me all the way along here safe assumption I think I'll uh, I'll bring you back when we get there greetings you are cleared for the following travel routes right so we're going in to speak to to dawn who I'm pretty sure isn't going to be a big fan of me but I'm hoping a flirt option comes up. We'll see. 
You spared a war, criminal lieutenant. That man murdered hundreds of people and you simply let him walk out of the Imperial's base. I am not sorry. Your objection is noted. I'll take your opinion under advisement, Sergeant. I'd appreciate it. Let's move on, shall we? Hmm, that Lamazar's was easy. confirmed Thoris's account. Needles has almost completed a weaponized strain of Rack Ghoul disease. However, the data makes no mention of Needles' friends in the ruins of the transport system. So, who are they? Do you have any idea who these friends might be? Available intelligence doesn't show any populations in the ruins of the transport system, but scans of the area have been cursory at best. Rack ghouls infest the area, making scouting by foot inordinately difficult. Hmm. However, one traversable route has been located. <laughs> All right, that's where I'm going then. I'll scout the area myself. Any geographical information you can bring back would be very helpful, Lieutenant. This ruined transport station is our only lead to Needle's location. I would encourage you to stock up on supplies and munitions before entering the area. Good luck. Thanks. I don't even know why I checked this gear, to be fair. Because it's never going to be better than what I've already got, right? Alright, so I, I do want to... Oh, there's a mailbox up here. So I've got eight different mails now that I just want to go through on this episode. So let's start from ooh, the furthest, longest to go. My husband told me what happened on Port Raga. Not that he wanted to, of course. I love him more than anything, but I know him well enough to realise he's too stubborn to ever thank you properly for saving him. He may never admit it, but you can count on the, his support from now on. He'd never forget something like this. Neither will I. And neither will our sons. Ah, Oh, that's cool. And obviously, money's important too. Whoa. What's this? Ordell Banshee. I have no idea what any of this stuff is. These are cartel market items. I guess this isn't an in-game. Right, let's let's take these. I I guess that must be from a, a player, right? Maybe a viewer? There was nothing in there, so I don't know. I I may have a look at those in a bit, but because I'm playing on a completely free-to-play account, I I'm sure I've mentioned this before, but obviously <coughs> Sorry, a few people may have missed it, um, but I can't really accept presence as such um, because it will lose the authenticity of a free-to-play account, which is the whole point of this. So, um, oh wow, your live stream canteen of 2018 flair. Nice. Non-human relations. Okay. A little while ago, you helped us out with a dispute regarding property rights, something going back a few centuries, when human and non-human relations on Taris were ugly, to put it mildly. I wanted to let you know what's happened since. Word spread that you've favoured the non-humans and angry measures angry messages poured in from across the Republic, but we also had a reporter in the other day, and people are starting to discuss it in the street. Not pushing and shoving discussions, but real, actual talks. I'm just a grunt. I don't have a clue if this will end with an official government apology and offers of restitution, or if it will just fade away, but it's in the open now, and that has to be a good thing. This must be the, the officer, the trooper, that was trying to help out those humans. Or trying to fob them off, I think, more likely. So that sounds like a scamming thing, or looks like a scamming thing. Awesome. This is an actual Star Wars The Old Republic theme, right? Thank you for being a member of the Star Wars The Old Republic community. Enjoy your new reward as, you're, as you adventure through the galaxy. Ah. Okay, so that's just a flare. I don't know what this is. Welcome to Shadow of Revan. You now have access to... Oh, okay, so um, the last week um, there were some free codes being given out by EA or Bioware, whoever, um, that gave access to a few things. So because... It was given by the developer and it's still free. Um, I allowed that into a free-to-play account. So now I have access to the Shadow of Revan. Which means I get that. So to begin the next stage in your saga, activate your ship's mission console once you've reached level 55. Select Shadow of Revan Prelude. Cool. Oh, I don't want to read spoilers. Okay, that's pretty cool. And this must be Rise of the Hook Cartel, which I also got given for free because of those um because of those keys. They handed out and that was mainly because a viewer told me about it so thank you very much much appreciated so i now have access to the shadow of revan and the hut cartel completely free as part of a free-to-play account so dr death's claw says hi <laughs> all right dr riam remember that time you shot your way into a death claw pirate camp and met the local medic remember how he convinced you not to subject his patients to a horrible rag coolie death by stealing his vaccine supply that was me how's things with you 
I wasn't always with the Death Claw, you know. I won't give you a whole sob story, but I'm here now because these guys took me in. They're my brothers. Brothers who are jerks. True, but jerks deserve a chance too. Anyway, I owe you one. There's talk of pulling out of Taris, and I hope it happens. You ever find yourself in the wrong place and need to get patched up, let me know. Oh, that's cool. What a nice boy. Cool. There we go. So that was eight different males. Male items. I, I assume that one was from a player, so I'm probably going to store these away. Even though, I guess they're just speeders. Maybe they don't actually give me anything special, but I'm not sure. I'll have to check into it. I'll have to have a good look into it. But now, though, I am on my way back to... Oh, lovely. I was right. I assume we have to go all the way up here. So I'm going back to Waypoint Station Dre Speeder. Right? And I'll meet you there. Uh, you okay? All right, so I made it back to Waypoint Station Dre. It turns out, though, that I did know a, a flight path up here, so I could have just gone straight there to get to my trooper quest. Um, but I thought I'd come back here, because if I remember right, the, the original release of this game had you find all the waypoints before you could fly to them. So that's probably what this quest was for, right? You used to have to do this to get to there and unlock the waypoint. That's a guess, anyway. Um, so I'm going to play through it because obviously that's been given to me and it's a purple quest. Um, I'm still not sure how I'm going to pay, how I'm going to play um, future planets like Narshadar that I, I guess I'm going to next. I'm still not sure how I'm going to do it, whether I'll just do the, the class storyline or whether I'll do the planet storylines as well. I'm quite enjoying the planet storylines, actually, so my uh, immediate guess would be that I'll carry on with that. So this is what I need. Nice. Again, the mouse just flicks away. I will get that fixed at some point. Absolute promises. Alright, next one. So like I said, the size of the map is actually a little bit deceptive, so between these there isn't as much of a break as, a, as it might seem. But there are four to do on the way. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this must have just been a sort of filler quest to have you do the route. And bring you to the next sort of quest hub. Might as well skip around these. There's a gold one though. The gold flag makes you really want to kill it. I wonder if that was their, their goal. Uh, oh, it's here. I'll take a silver one out instead. That's fine. Might as well get this. We'll tell him to get that. <laughs> I love that. It's such a good mechanic. Oh, I could be sending my droid away, couldn't I? To do stuff like this. Why don't I give that a try? Go. I promise nothing less than perfection, Master. Hmm. Maybe that annoying thing he says every time will be a reason not to do it. Can you do that? Good boy. I'm pretty sure all that damage is my companion. Wow. That would be really annoying me if I was watching. I apologise. It's really not just me doing it as well. It really is the mouse, I promise. Luckily, it's so rare. I'm sure it's fine. There we go. A gold one. Hey, birdie. Gotcha. <laughs> Alright, that was easy. Okay, so now we're finding the missing convoy, which is somewhere down here. Looks like this. And it looks really cool. Found you. 
Hello. We just stopped to rest. Geozel found a scratch, and we don't know if it's the Rakul infection, so we're waiting. And Ferdoan might be coming down with the Geonosian swamp flu, but we're on our way, I swear. And you're looking at me very strangely. Mm. Who are you? Are you part of the Outpost 4 supply convoy? Yes. Private Gilro. I assumed you were looking for us. We, we just stopped to rest. Sorry to trouble everyone. You, yeah, you do look like you're hiding. Are you afraid of something? Is someone after you? What isn't after us on this awful planet? The Nexu? The blasted rat ghouls? Oh, forget it. I was never a good liar. Oh, you we deserted. Going back. Is that what you wanted to hear? There we go. We deserted. How could you do that? What kind of man abandons his comrades in the face of such an enemy? <laughs> We're not the only ones talking about running for it. We just got the first chance. Hmm. Five years we've been out here. No break. Most of our friends have died. We're wounded, tired, broken. Fighting something that can't think, can't be frightened. And if you get the slightest scratch, you become the enemy and your own squad puts you down like a dog. Mm. You, de you deserve a rest, but you, you can't. <laughs> like you have to go back. Yeah, I mean, go back, it's your duty. You must return to your post. You knew the risks when you signed up. I can't. I'd rather kill myself, I really would. I knew that would be dark side, but come on. But yeah, somebody's got to die in your place then. Every soldier knows they might have to die for the Republic. What makes you so special? You think we didn't agonize about that? Look, if we were fighting the Sith, if our deaths would mean something, but there's nothing on Terrace. But he's right, guys. The outpost can barely yeah. staff a full watch as it is. The rat ghouls will get the lot of them. I can't live with that. I guess we have to go back. No matter what happens. Yeah, it's a shame I had to choose a dark side option to, to make that point. But I do think that's definitely what my character, the strict trooper type guy, would have said. So I'm fine with it. Not going to haunt me too much. So yeah, now we're heading up to... The next sort of what I assume is a quest hub. Let's go and find out, I guess. This way? Well, there's no door, which these things normally sort of mean, but I guess it's just heading into another area. Oh, I hand that in here. Good. Okay. Which is probably up here. Nice. This is quite cool, actually. Looks good. Hello. State your business. This is a Republic military outpost, sovereign territory of the Galactic Republic. Mm. We will defend ourselves with deadly force if necessary. All right, Tiger. I'm Republic. First Lieutenant Havoc Squad, most recently aboard Mantell. Lieutenant, welcome to our outpost. There's no unauthorized travel this far into the wilds. Best policies usually blast first, chat later. Don't suppose you were sent by Commander Guarded with news about our supplies? Mm. Uh, well, kind of. I cleared the route for them. It was a breeze. That's a relief. Our own convoy never reported back. Wouldn't be the first time we lost one to the Nexu. I was about to send another, but that means leaving the whole outpost understaffed and undefended. And the Rack Ghouls have been real active this month. Don't suppose you saw any sign of our boys. If they're still alive, they'd better have a good excuse for leaving us hanging. Uh, they're on the way. I don't want to... They are on the way back. They've decided to come back, so I can't really dob them in. Well, really, it's not really dobbing them in, is it? If I'm sort of a trooper, I do want it on record what they did. But yeah, your men went AWOL. They're deserters. I found them hiding in the wreckage. Those lazy, selfish sons of huts. We have men starving here. But they've agreed to come I'll back. Drag the useless lot of them back for trial. They will not go unpunished. Oh, I should have added they've agreed to come back. Okay. Yeah, I feel a little bit bad. Well, not that bad. All right. So, ooh. Oh, this was my companion going away on a quest. That's cool. All right. So this is the first time I think that there's quite a few quests that I'm not going to be taking. For examination and suggested products. Do, do, do. You are fit for duty. Return to your post. Here we go. So, I'm only doing purple ones. Purple's the only way for me. 
But this whole sort of quest hub I'm not doing, which means I probably won't go into this whole area. Okay. Let's go. I'm so far ahead on levels, though. I mean, it's definitely the right thing to do. So is this the final zone, then, is the big question. The arrangement. Yeah, it must be. And can I find my way to the entrance? Looks like it's in this tunnel. Quite cool. Ooh, who's that? Is that a mount? Oh, yeah, it is. That's quite cool. I like it. I like it a lot. Have I gone the wrong way? No. Okay, we're good. Hey, buddy. And we're in. Alright, so it looks like this is a fairly big area for me to adventure through. Um, and I think we're about on time to finish the episode. Let's get started, actually. I'll, I'll just get into a couple of rooms. Nice. Let's see what kind of area it's going to be. Wow. It's whenever I'm holding the right mouse button, it seems to do it. Okay, so it's not a cave all the way through, which is good. I'd probably get a bit bored of that. This is quite nice. Ooh, okay, a consular phase. I guess mine's further in then. Okay, yeah, we'll, um... Ooh. Okay, there's a gold over there. I've got to kill him. You don't put a gold right near the entrance for no reason, right? Mm -mm. Okay, I, I was half expecting that to uh, start a bonus quest to kill a couple more of them but that's a shame all right so i think i will call it there then and we'll class that as an episode and we'll try and fit this whole sort of dungeon not really a dungeon this whole complex into the next video and then maybe even handing it in as well it's quite a big one Ooh. all right so there you go that was um that episode second to last one of taris it looks like so we managed to get back to talk to the um the lieutenant dawn she's a very unhappy woman checked a bunch of mail which was super cool actually and then the quest saving the deserters saving bringing them to justice let's say um although i might not have done that in in the best way i feel like i achieved what i wanted to though so it's fine but yeah thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoyed hope you are enjoying hope you will enjoy but by far the most important things look forward to the next episode star wars the old republic